Alright, good morning and hi everyone. So today I would like to introduce our proposed product to i3DC 2034 with the product title Marvel Resi. So first I would like to introduce our project member. So th this project will is led by Nur Shahmina Ahmad Azhar, a master student in FTKEK and followed by me Nick Muhammad Zarifi Hashim from Nick Adila Hanin Zahri from Unimap, Mahmoud Dwi Selestio from Telkom UST Indonesia, Esmin Abdullah and Muhammad Nabil Hidayat from UITM Shah Alam and Afika Ilya Kamaruddin from Perkeso Melaka and finally Muhammad Juzaila Abdul Latif. So first thing I would like to introduce our uh, background of this study and project. So basically if you can take a look at this graph, the increment of the stroke patient number is globally increased year by year. So based on this uh, particular statistic, we are having a problem that the, this non-committable disease NCD is basically becoming a silent killer to our community. So one of those is basically the, the stroke disease. Okay? In order to encounter this particular disease, rehab is one of the main method to train back the lost ability of the diagnosed stroke patient. So, but we face several problems whereby in order to have a good system in the rehabs, basically we need to have the several kind of analysis, especially in sound. So basically we are trying to post the vowel recognition. So we still face the limited data sets and stable apps so far and image profile should be encountered over here. So the objective for this particular project is to prepare a stable, reliable and highly accurate in voice recognition analysis for especially for the medical usage. Secondly, to design a new application compared to the desktop application in the previous version. So in this product, basically, we initiated a new product with an apps. Okay. So the thirdly is to ensure the application could be accessed everywhere easily and could be reporting the evaluation in the real time to the patient or even to the assessor. So this is the over overview of our apps. So basically, this is our app in the middle. We have the user interface of our app, clean, friendly, cloud computing, real time and percentage accuracy will be displayed at the bottom. So we have the uh, to press this kind of button to be recording our voices and then after we record it we submit it to the, the cloud computing and finally the result will come in to push back down to us in apps the A is basically recognized by the apps so before we start the project basically many survey has been done so one of those is basically I need the market survey in the surrounding of stroke patient including the stakeholder of the stroke patient including the precursor rehab center staff and so on and so forth based on this uh, survey basically we nearly are uh, getting the majority of them agree with having the AI touch of application to do rehabs for voice disability patients. So after the designing the uh, apps using the image profiles apps, so this is the sound that has been converted to the image profile. So we solve the problem of medical using smart vowel recognition classification. So, and then we solve the local or even the global problems to various category and especially for the local first Malay datasets. And this application is reliable via the new Network. So currently we have the LOI with Rekeso here. So we have also the uh, letter ethical from UTEM and we also have a copyright from my IPO in our hands right now. So this particular proposed project is a new paradigm of apps thing whereby we convert the sound to image profile. So secondly, proposed product is basically um, proposed the first synthetic smart vowel language uh, data set so far to the extent of knowledge in Malaysia. So secondly, we having two uh, copyrights in our hand. One is for the speech therapy apps and the other one is for the sound data sets. Speaking about the implementation level right now for TRL, so basically we are started from TRL3 classification models for the only for the healthy person. So then we, we try to collect the uh, patient voices. We rise up to the TRL5 and finally we are now in TRL5 combining the health and patient voice to our system. So speaking of what we can do and what we can't do, so basically 94% of smart vowel recognition achieved so far in our test. So we could be implemented without any presence of SSL. So basically, we just press the button in, in the cell phone screen. So based on the simple neural network, but still reliable everywhere, we can use this app everywhere that we wanted. So where can we use the this application? Basically, we can use the application for embarking many more applications or using the deep learning in biomedical perspective. So stroke patient vowel and voice rehabilitation training and assessment could be utilized these apps so in the future basically we are looking forward to the using the syllabus of Malay language up to the terms or even the full sentence in the Malay language for voice recognition system in future also this application could be extended to the patient data management in rehab so whereby all the records for the patient is embedded in the PDF file via UApps systematic system so this is a demo for our proposed product so first of all the you need to allow the voice to be recorded so press this the recording this is the voice that we 
been recorded of my voice and we try to submit it so then the result is uh, giving you up for 76 percent accuracy because this is considering the noise is happening uh, at the background of my voices so this is the image profile taken from the uh, recorded voice so with that regards i think that's all from our proposed product thank you and see you again bye